I definitely knew he was the one way early in. I actually was the first one to say, I love you. And, um, you know, I couldn't believe it because that was definitely my first time feeling that way. I honestly didn't think I was gonna find that person. I, I started thinking, you're just gonna have to find someone that is good enough, not the perfect fit. And then when I met Tony, I knew he was the perfect fit. When we first started going out and dating, it was uh, this Zach Brown song was resonating in my head, and it's called "Whatever It Is," and that's like she had like couldn't explain it. The one thing there were so many things, but she just had whatever it is that just made me made my heart melt, made me fall in love with her. She is so gorgeous. I mean, from, from the top of her head down to her toes, her funny little toes, and it's like. Um, Stunningly beautiful. Um, those eyes just cut through you and they, they lock on to you when you're talking to her, and it's just like it's kind of intimidating at first, isn't it? But, but um, I mean, she is just gorgeous, and I tell her that all the time. Tony was more than I ever imagined. Um, he's charming, um, elegant with his words, always locks in on everyone's eyes, makes everyone feel like that conversation is the most important, which I, I love about him. Um, you know, he has a way of being creative, smart, caring, and has all the patience in the world, especially with me. So that's something um, I really need in a man. Um, and I love the way he loves my daughter, just like it's his own. Because those are some of my favorite things about him. Baby, we've waited a long time for this, and I know it's, it's not just having to deal with a pandemic, but having to deal with me and, and everything, but we are here on our day, and I just cannot wait to see you walk down that aisle. Um, man, it's, uh, it's gonna be something else, and I just cannot wait. I love you so much, and I will see you and speak to you next as Mrs. Odom. I love you. Today is finally here. Um, I know you're down there, probably as calm as could be, as I sit here, anxious as could be. Um, you're always confident and secure, and I can't wait to see you. Um, I just want you to know that I'm 100% in this, and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. Never thought I'd find this again. I thought it was, you know, I'm getting a little long in the tooth and a little, you know, the hair's getting a little grayer. I'm saying, oh man, you know, just may as well just ride this out and see what happens. But no, I just couldn't believe it when I, you know, I fail and I feel hard. There's not a chance that I have any doubt that he is 100% was made for me. We are blessed with uh, having, you know, five great kids to blend this family. Um, it's, uh, it's, you know, the ages are very close, you know, from 17 to 20, and um, it's, uh, you know, a compressed family with that, and it's, it's, uh, it's pretty amazing. It's, uh, it, most people think it's challenging having that much kids. It is so much fun. We have s such a great time. I honestly never thought there was such a love out there. I, I, I have to pinch myself sometimes. I keep thinking, when's this going to end? And it, it has it and it just continues to get bigger and better. Both my fathers are going to be walking me down side by side, which is super special for me since I don't get a lot of time with both of them together. 
Tony will be emotional, but I think he'll keep it together. Maybe, maybe have a tear. One. <laughs> um, I hope to hold it together because if I cry, it will just be a hot mess. And I am so excited to see all our friends and family to be there. Both of her fathers on each side of her, thank goodness, because um, Tara's not the most, uh, she's a little clumsy, I would say. Uh, and um, good thing she's anchored on both sides by her two dads. So. Um, I think that's going to be awesome. Though the one thing that's missing is my mom, so her health wasn't doing too good. And, but you know, it's uh, she's here in, in spirit and heart, and so um, it, it'll be. I can't wait to, for that actual first look as she's walking down the aisle. Tony is the first time where I felt like I can trust this man, and I can let my walls down, and I can be vulnerable, and I can be me, and and he still loves me. I have died every day. Please repeat after me. I, Tony, take you, Tara, to be my wife. I, Tony, take you, Tara, to be my wife. Your love is my anchor. Your love is my anchor. Your trust is my strength. Your trust is my strength. I give you all my love. I give you all my love. From now until eternity ends. From now until eternity ends. You make my life complete. You make my life complete. Now, Tara, repeat after me. <laughs> I, Tara, take you, Tony, to be my husband. I, Tara, take you, Tony, to be my husband. <laughs> Your love is my anchor. Your love is my anchor. Your trust is my strength. Your trust is my strength. I will give you all my love. I will give you all my love. From now until eternity ends. From now until eternity ends. You make my life complete. You make my life complete. Completely complete. <laughs> now, Lou, can I have the rings, please? It is my extreme honor to, pronou uh, to pronounce you husband and wife. Tara, you may kiss your groom. <laughs> Please turn towards the audience. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Odom. Let's party! <laughs> it's, it's like having, needing air, needing water, needing food. You need, you need love. Our chemistry is probably the thing that has um, always held us together. Um, we're definitely very touchy, feely, physical. I think our both of our love language it is, you know, the physical touch and and the time together. So kiss me.
look forward to having grandchildren and watching our kids have families and um, I, it just, I, it feels fuller completely. Our life is, my life is a lot fuller with him in it.